Ambassador Jeff Byatt, U.S. Assistant Secretary of State on Energy Resources, welcome to TRT Haber. Thank you so much. Great to be with you. Mr. Byatt, um, the energy cooperation between Turkey and the United States is increasing and one of the top topics. First of all, what do you make of it? So we took an important step forward with Minister Bayraktar's meeting with Secretary of Energy Granholm yesterday and the launch of our new Energy and Climate Dialogue, which will cover an incredibly broad range of issues. Two important ones for me and my team are our regional cooperation, how we work together to build energy security, accelerate energy transition in regions like the Western Balkans and in Iraq, and then also the work that our companies can do together to deepen clean technology supply chains, working in regions like Central Asia and Sub-Saharan Africa to diversify supplies of critical minerals, the processing that we need for those minerals to drive our energy transitions in Turkey, here in the United States and around the world. When it comes to Central Asia, uh, Turkey has deep historical relations and strategic relations with the Turkic countries and the United States has a similar approach like C5 plus one. So can you please describe, tell us, uh, what is the cooperation level between Turkey and the United States in Central Asia? Our cooperation is already significant and it will grow in Central Asia. As you noted, President Biden hosted his counterparts from the five Central Asian countries last September for the first C5 plus one summit meeting in history. And we have now had a working group in which I'm participating focused on critical minerals and critical mineral supply chains. We see companies from Turkey as perfectly positioned to work with our companies, to work with global mining companies, to diversify supply chains, to provide the processing, which is so important, and to help to give the countries of Central Asia an alternative so they don't only look to China when they're thinking about how to develop their natural resources. Final question. We are living in a very volatile world given the wars, especially in the Black Sea region. So how do you see Turkey's role in the terms of uh, energy security? So t most importantly, Turkey is a NATO ally. We approach the relationship in that spirit. But the dialogue that Minister Bayraktar and Secretary Granholm launched is about taking that alliance relationship and projecting it out into the areas of energy security, energy transition. We see Turkey as offering fantastic possibilities in terms of the cooperation that this conference is focused on. American companies, Turkish companies working together on clean energy, on renewables, but also very, very important work to do together, in particular to defeat Russia's energy weapon in the way that Turkey has done so impressively since February of 22 in helping to ensure that Putin's efforts to weaponize his gas resources end in failure. Ambassador Jeff Bayer, thank you very much for joining us on TRT News. Thank you, Tuna. Great to see you.